Hello. Hi. Hi. Uh, I just normal. talked normally. Yeah, talked normally. Uh, so yeah, base motel. Or no, psycho. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you should watch that show, by the way. I will. Oh my god. I'll check it out. Yes. So I guess she dies at the end of the season. Then. Huh? I guess I'm assuming she dies at the end of the season. Who? Uh, his Norma. Mom. Well, she dies in like season like three. Wow. Or four. Spoiler. <laughs> Spoiler alert! Norma dies. Okay, so welcome to episode zero. What's it? What's episode zero called? Episode zero. Oh, I thought they're supposed to have names. Oh, I don't know. Boo. <laughs> Why don't you pick a name? Uh, this one's episode zero. Um, wait, hold on, I'm gonna read one of these cards. <laughs> episode zero. Night of the Living Dead. Okay, okay, I don't know. Night of the Living Dead, episode zero. <laughs> it's not going to have anything to do with that movie, though. No, it's not. Uh, We're actually going to talk about uh, Psycho, because we just watched that, like, ten minutes ago. Yeah. So, what should we talk about it? Um, basically, that... Well, actually, we should probably explain, because some people might not know. I mean... Not to be confused. Whoever... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> not to Christian be Bale's not in this Yeah, it's one. not American Psycho. <laughs> not Christian Bale. <laughs> That I kills mean, Jared Leto. Uh, it is Norman Bates' Psycho. Yeah. Alfred Hitchcock's Psycho. I guess a classic. A cult really, classic. I really I would seen say. it, even though not a lot of people have seen it. Even though you should see it. Yeah, agreed. You have to kind of see it if you're like a horror fan. Yeah, I haven't seen it in like ten years. I've only seen like bits and clips of it, and my grandma liked it, but my mom was like, "No, you shouldn't watch it." But I was like, "Okay." And I haven't watched it, like, fully until, like, just now, actually. Yeah. Um, I don't remember a lot of it until, so I guess it was good to rewatch it. Yeah. It was pretty nice. And actually, because I just finished the show, like I told you before, and it kind of, I was, like, going through my mind, I was like, oh, that, that, they changed that a bit, and oh, okay, but I can't really talk to you about the show, and I don't want to, like, so spoil it anywhere else. <laughs> is the show better than the movie? Uh... I mean, it's more... It's, well, it's modern, right? Yeah. Well, yeah, it's, like, modern, and it tells, like, the story of Norm, Norman Bates, like, how he became the Norman Bates that we know. Should we spoil the movie? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if everybody heard of Norman Bates, we know he's a psycho. Spoiler alert. It's in the alert. movie title. <laughs> he's a psycho. <laughs> Spoiler alert. Dumbledore's dead. <laughs> what? Ah, shit. That's way too much of a spoiler. <laughs> okay, my bad. A lot of people haven't seen Harry Potter. Actually, that's true. I'm really surprised about that. Yeah, I don't know. People yeah. are weird. It is. Anyway, um, so yeah, you know, the Cole Cogsley Psycho, uh, made in the 1960, which I was kind of surprised about because it doesn't look like it would be in the 1960s, but... That was what? What year are we in? <laughs> we are in 2018. So that was almost 50 years ago? Yeah. As oh. a, or 60? Okay, so... Wait, 70, 80, 90, 2000... 10, 2018, basically 58 almost, almost, years ago. Yeah. I'm assuming wow. everyone in that movie's dead. Actually dead. Yeah, because I just looked up Anthony Perkins or whatever, and he died in 92 at age of 60. Yeah, so he's definitely dead. Yeah, he was a good actor. I liked him as, like, wow, Freddie Highmore, I'm just going to say, because I remember saying it to you, but Freddie Highmore did a really awesome job at Norman Bates. Like, yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Like I said, to you, like I told you before, like I had to watch like videos in the last season. I was like, okay, so is that really that way? He's that, it's okay. <laughs> like I had to calm myself down because he was so freaky. <laughs> I, um, what, what was that girl's name again? Marion. Was it Marion? The one that died, yeah. obviously. Marion. I thought for some reason I thought she was in the movie way longer, and she actually was. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> and now she's. Well, I don't want to get that away either. Never mind. I don't want to say anything. Oh yeah. And fun fact that she's Jamie Lee Curtis's mom. Yes, you taught me that. I say she's a what the scream queen. That's what. Yeah, I guess that's what they call girls these days. Like Daniel Harris from Halloween. True. She's a scream queen. Would um, sure what's that's... her face from Nightmare be a scream queen? Which one? Nancy. Yeah. Uh, I mean, no. No. I think they only consider scream queens if you're like in horror, like a lot. 
I mean, she was in, like, three of the Nightmare movies. Well, like, Jamie Lee Curtis was in Halloween. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she was in Halloween. Uh, it's pretty much I it. guess, I don't know. I guess it's just more how re- relevant you are in it. I guess. She's still doing Halloween now. Oh, yeah, they did the, what's the new one called? Just... Uh, Halloween. <laughs> Is it just called Halloween still? Yeah, I, I think it comes out next year. Okay, yeah, just like, oh, I'm back. Back bitches. That's what reminded me of, like, American Horror Story. She's Imagine like, back bitches. What the hell going? Ha <laughs> ha. But, oh, wait, Psycho, so. Yeah. I thought that was weird. I guess I'm not too familiar with the 1960s. That the guy got out of left, the left side of his car. I saw the right side of his car. I mean, I think that was just, like, the movie, because I'm pretty sure, like, I've seen other movies that were back in the 60s, and they weren't like that. <laughs> they didn't so, get out of the car like that. But he did it both times. I think it was just, like, how they shot it, and, like, oh, there's not enough room for you to open the car door this way. Why don't you just do it this way? <laughs> I don't know. That well, was really weird. Well, I know it was a low-budget movie. Yeah. So. But. But so. it did pretty good. Pretty good. So her mom's name was Janet Lee, I guess. Janet Lee. Oh, Marion. Is that what her name was? A character? Yeah. Yes. So, yeah. Um. I don't know when she died. I'm gonna look that up. IMDb. Janet Lee. I also thought it was weird. Why was that cop even following her? Like, the cops did That was so weird when he just got out of his car and just stood there. And just followed her around. Did, did cops do that? I know they do that now. <laughs> but I didn't... I know they're creepers now, but... Back in the day, yeah. following... That's when it's... This is when... This, this actually women. started it. The psycho actually started it. Uh, and I still don't understand why someone would be like, Hey, do you want to deposit forty thousand dollars into the bank for me oh my god yeah like he was just like so trusty with her and then he even said like oh i knew her 10 years i trusted her i mean i don't know fucked up i wouldn't like if my mom was like hey let me take this forty thousand dollars she'd be like i'll do that myself yeah i'll do that That's myself of... thanks well you said he doesn't carry more money than he can afford to lose so he i guess he was okay with losing that forty thousand dollars but not really, because they hired a private eye. But uh, okay. yeah. Let's see. I wonder where did she die? Oh, died. Oct- oh wow, she died at two thousand four. Really? At what age? Seventy-seven. Wow, that's insane. She lived a good long life, longer than the Norman Bates. Yeah. He died at sixty. Sixty. Yeah, he died at 60. Um, he was attractive. I'm not gonna lie. Dude, that guy was straight up ugly. <laughs> no, he wasn't. He was attractive to no, me. I he was, he... like, creepy, but I was like, oh, he's kind of attractive. Nope. He, he's but I would still ugly, not. Ugly. That guy's ugly. He looks like he could kill you. Well, he's <laughs> he dead. He looks like he so could he, kill he's, anything. He's dead he's now, dead. so he can't kill me. <laughs> so... Your point is invalid. That was like when he did that face. I was like, that's all the pictures you ever see of Psycho. That's true. Oh my god. I mean, yeah. Like, I haven't read the book either. I kind of want to read the book. That's what I'm going to do. Name another was a book. See? You know, other things. There's a lot of things I don't know. Yeah. Well, well, they're (laughs) on all of them. We'll do through this podcast. People are going to be like, these guys don't know anything. Why the hell am I listening to them? Because we. (laughs) Because you can make fun of us. Yeah, I guess. Let's see, the budget was $800,000. Oh, I was like, $800? I was like, what? No, the box office was $50 million. Oh, wow. It's really a pretty thing. Um, yeah, it's considered one of uh, Hitchcock's best films, which I've only seen a few. By a few, I mean a bunch. <laughs> But by a bunch, I mean a few, because there's a bunch of movies. Yeah, he has a bunch of movies. He was a uh, very creepy. How far is from Arizona from California, anyway? I don't know. She drove a long while. 
Yeah. Put it on your Google Maps. <laughs> Google Maps. I can't use my phone. <laughs> <laughs> Google Map it. She didn't have Google Maps. How did she drive without a map? Like, she was just driving. Like, yeah, was- I'm still... I know, like, we live in the technology world, and we can't go anywhere without Google Maps, but, like... Yeah, like, I can't even spell words without my phone anymore. That's, that's, how, much, that's how dependent we are, and, like, people back in the day... was like, can, I want to get a dictionary. Oh, and then um, I want to drive down this road. I don't know. People, old people, I guess, knew their shit. They really did. Like, I do look up to them a lot, because they did, like, a lot of shit without our technology now, and, like... I'm really bad at math, and they had, like, shitty calculators. I'm like, if I had to use those calculators that, like, barely did anything, I would have died. <laughs> like, they probably would have. Yeah, I don't know. Mm. Or, like, no calculators at all? Well, nope. Would you even have done... Would have I would have quit school. I don't think... Would you even have an education back then? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh. I would have quit school so fast. Uh. <laughs> Okay, yeah, was I looking at how far yeah, is California is. from Arizona? Yeah, she said she was... No, her sister was in Tucson. I don't know where she lived. Like, she said Phoenix I'm or something. I'm not familiar with geography. So just go from, like, uh... California. I know that's a real place, though. Fair. California. Fairville. I'm just going to... How far is California? <laughs> Are you Googling it? Why don't you just use Google Maps? Because I don't want to. (laughs) It's a 12-hour drive. That's not not bad. I I thought it was farther than that. No. Okay. It's like literally the next state. (laughs) Oh. All right. Well, we know our geograph. Geography. Geography. (laughs) Geography. 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 We know our states and our maps well, don't we? <laughs> no. Um, no, we don't. Unfortunately. You know, that's a big meme uh, for Americans that we don't know our states and our maps very well. But no one else does either. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. It's like, I know Florida always, they always know what Florida is. Yeah. <laughs> it's the dick of the We're history. from Florida, by the way, as you can tell. Yeah, as we can tell. <laughs> and I always know California is, too. They always know where, like, Disneyland and Universal and things like that are. Yeah, it's always Disneyland alligators. <laughs> yeah. Alligators, yeah. Florida, the worst state. Yeah, pretty much. We're the dick of the North America. Basically. Oh. Well, we have a lot of dicks here. Um, but yeah. I like the movie. I thought it was good. Yeah. I highly recommend it if you haven't seen it. The, er, I'm pretty sure everyone has seen it. Has seen it. Except you. You you said you don't remember it. <laughs> this isn't about me. <laughs> <laughs> We're not talking about me right now. Um, so yeah. Um, are we, I know you're not supposed to say, um, or, or yeah, right? Is that professional? What's that professional podcast? Uh, yeah, this is not We're professional. <laughs> We're, uh, under amateurs. What's that called? Under amateurs? Yeah, like we're not amateurs. Fucking losers. Okay, we're losers. <laughs> That's what we are, we're losers. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't know what you're expecting to get from this podcast, but... It's going to be a bunch of this. Uh, rambles. But it's going to be fun. And we're going to play games. Like, we're about to play one now. Are we? I mean... <laughs> I guess I have it in my hand. Why not? <laughs> I mean, I could talk about the murders that I blogged about last week. Sure. I don't know anything about this. Oh, okay. Well, I forgot one of the guys' names. Wow. But, uh, Richard... We're off to a good start. Yeah, right? <laughs> um, and I forgot the years, too. But... <laughs> <laughs> so, basically, the important things about the murders, like who they were and where they took place. Yeah, I mean, if I could use my phone. <laughs> so, basically, just people died. So that's all that you get to know. Um, wait, is this... How's this gonna... If, how are they gonna know we're playing a game if they can't see us? We can tell them. <laughs> They're about to play this game called uh, Slash Cards. So if you never heard of it, it's a trivia game. It's a trivia horror movie game. Uh, you can buy it on Amazon for like $33 or something. I'm going to buy it later. This is regardless of the game. But, um... Yeah, so if you're blind, it's totally, it's totally good. Yeah. Because you won't just see what we're doing. No, you're good. We'll just read it to you. Like we're you want to read the rules? Well, uh, well, there's a slacker mode, there's the survivor mode, and there's a slasher mode. Which mode do we want to do? Uh, the easy mode. 
to the slacker mode. Is that what it is? Draw a trivia card and ask a question, answer the question. Oh, yeah, that's basically what... Okay. You want to go right. first? I'll go first. Okay. Wait, you have to draw one of these. No, it just says draw a trivia card. You don't even use those in the slacker mode. Wow. Yeah, you just draw a trivia card. This game's really fucking hard, though, if you don't know anything about horror movies. Yeah. I was reading some of the questions, and I was like, holy shit, I didn't know. <laughs> okay. I will First ask... question. Question number uh, one. Let's see. It also doesn't help that my eyes are bad. Oh my god. <laughs> Turn the you light on. <laughs> Turn the this, lights this on. This is the only light. What? <laughs> okay, so it's dark in here, so. Okay. Um, I'm sorry, I don't have lights everywhere for your eyes. Do you want to sit over here? Uh, no, I'm fine. I can see way better than you can. I have glasses. Okay, I know this one. Okay. Um, the town that dreaded sundown. My band has a song about that. <laughs> uh, it takes place in what U.S. town? Texacana. Oh, wow. Texacana. Texacana. You're right. Texacana. Yeah, because I remember watching a um, film about it, and it was super crazy, and whoa. Wow, I didn't think you'd get that right. Texacana. And I had a few callers on my job. Um, they're from Texarkana. I'm just like, oh, oh. I just want to ask them about the murder sometimes, but I'm just like, oh, oh this is unprofessional. I can't do that. The state sounds pretty fucked up to live in anyway. But I know, right? It's like, like, oh, I'm from Texarkana. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I don't know any of those. Uh, oh! <laughs> Convenient. A wig, a shower curtain, and a motel. Oh, man. That's hard. Shit. <laughs> uh, is, it, is it Psycho? <laughs> ding, ding, ding! <laughs> that was so funny. I picked that one up. <laughs> I had to do that one. What a convenience. I did like her car. I like both of her cars. That she it was had. in black and white, so... I mean, I like those cars anyway. Like, I really like old cars. I would not live so in the like, 60s. Ugh. You don't want to be in the 60s? No, I mean, I wouldn't live in the 60s because it sucked. And, you know, people sucked. Yeah, I mean, people suck now. Yeah, but I guess, it's, I don't know. I mean, probably suck. I mean, they're probably more way more racist. <laughs> yeah. Plus, I don't know. If you die, die. I guess it'd be harder to track your murder. True. Uh. Let's see. I like the fashion. Ew. I like the hair on the girls up. The weird... Like, almost shaved hair? I guess. I don't know. Like, really short hair? No, but it was like the lofty, like... Well, they had short hair, but they had to, like, put a lot of shit in to make it look like that. Yeah, I can do that. Yeah, no. (laughs) I'd be too lazy. I don't know. This one seems hard, because I don't remember that guy's name. But you might know it. Who's the only other actor besides Robert England? To have played the role of Freddy Krueger. I only know Robert England. He was in um uh, in uh The Watchmen. That sounds familiar. I thought you watched The Watchmen. Did we? Oh, I didn't. I Is that the you... superhero movie? Yeah. Which one? Jackie Earl Haley. Uh huh. Recording. Yeah, it's back on. Okay. So, Cody's gonna join us to do Blaze this trivia game. Woo! Say hi, Cody! <laughs> Fuck off. Damn. That's rude. This is really hard now. Anyway. <laughs> oh, yeah, you ruined our PG podcast. <laughs> well, I think like I said fuck too, so that was like PG 13 was out the door after he said fuck. How many, fuck, rated R. How many fucks do you get before it's rated R? One. You only get one. One? Yeah. You get one for PG 13. One fuck? Yeah, one wow. fuck. Well, then we just said five. Okay, so, so we're, this is rated definitely R. Definitely rated podcast. R. <laughs> wow. Is it my turn? Your turn. Yeah, you just asked me one. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah we got it wrong. <clears throat> so that's Cody one. Cody. Huh? You ready? Yeah. Okay. Uh, let me make sure my talk makes sense. Oh, we have to ask <laughs> his question. Oh, we have to ask him a question? Yeah. Oh, continue on with your taco then. <laughs> do you want to get that? Do you want to ask him a question? Are, have are these like super specific questions? Yeah. Oh my god, this is really <laughs> <laughs> They're really fucking hard. Yeah, they like, are. What was the name okay, of the actor? Yeah. This will be easy. 
Even though you didn't watch the movie with us, but you know. What is the name of the killer with serious mother issues in Psycho? Uh, Jason Bateman. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Wrong. No, it's like Norman Bates or something. <laughs> or something. <laughs> Close enough. <laughs> wow, there's two questions on here already on about Psycho. This is exciting. I wonder how many, like, horror movies there is. Well, there's a lot of questions. The, it's basically, it's pretty up to date. Like, I think it came out last year. Yeah, I saw it. I started seeing it last year for, like, 20 bucks, and it went up, like, $10. And I was like, shit, I need it. I don't want to get it. But, okay. So, who's next? Is uh, there a record when I'm slapped? Yes. Okay. Um, I guess it's your turn, or my turn to answer. You should answer? Do you want me to ask? Sure. Name two horror movies about drugs or drug use. Drugs or drug use? Yeah. Oh, uh, shit. Um, I don't think I've seen that many horror movies. Well, I've seen Mushrooms. Yeah, Shrooms. Yeah, there's, there's a Shrooms. Uh, did you see that one? No. It's pretty bad. I've read the synopsis like 30 times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I saw that just because I was just like, oh, that looks good. But it wasn't. <laughs> the girl literally kills everyone. Spoiler. When she was on shrooms. Yeah, she was like trying to save everyone, but I, I don't know. She, I just know she's she trying to save everyone, but she's on shrooms. So no, she's, no, she thought she, someone was trying to kill her, and like as self defense, she would like kill them, I guess. And, but they're just her friends. There's a cow on it, I think. Your cow. No. Oh. <laughs> no. All right, so that's one. <laughs> uh, like specifically about drug use. Yeah. Yeah, drugs or drug use. Evil Bong, but I've never seen it. Halloween. <laughs> oh yeah, Halloween. Never seen those either. It's so shitty, don't watch it. It really is. <laughs> okay, so we got two. So yay, go Carlos. Does that mean I get to keep the card? I already put it away. Oh. Fuck. I lost it. If I find it again, I'll give it to you. We can keep track of it that way. <laughs> okay. So now we. Oh, have... here you go. There you go. Can I ask you a question. Yeah. I'll just draw a card. Yeah. And ask Shuffle her a question. and just ask. This is a slacker mode. I think these are answers. Back then. <laughs> <laughs> I can't get this card. No, it's help? stuck. Are you seeing this right now? Yeah, I gotta flip the whole box over to get this one. I still can't get the card. <laughs> okay. Oh my god, it is. I don't want to ruin your card. See? Don't judge me. Okay, just fucking... <laughs> oh, should I do it easy or should I do it hard? Uh, they're, they're I know, I know a good hard. amount of horror, I guess. Yeah. I'm, I'm really bad at uh, actors' names, though. Yeah. So that won't be hard. I gotta brush up on that. I feel like that would kind of be hard, so name three horror movies that take place in New York City. New York oh. City? Yeah. Jeez. Um, did Mimic... Mimic happen in New York City, right? Did you ever see that one? Mimic? No. It was with the so. cockroach people. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that was New York. I said one earlier. Did you? Yeah. Halloween? No. <laughs> it was like when I first walked in, no one was taking out my tacos. Uh-huh. I didn't hear what you said. Me neither. There's so many... Uh, there's the... Uh, I don't know. A lot of shit happens in New York. Wait, what about I Am Legend? Was that was that in New York? That was in New York. What? Yeah. Would you consider that a horror? Yeah, I guess you. Yeah, it has some zombie things. I mean, we could see yeah. we could see what it says on IMDb because it has like the things. Yeah. I don't really care. <laughs> okay, yeah, I Am Legend. Okay, I Am Legend and Mimic and one more. Mimic two. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can't do sequels. And uh, Men in Black. <laughs> <laughs> Um. Wow, all our movies take place in New York, and we can't. And yet, you can think of none of them. None of them. Uh, Amityville Amity Horror. Horror. Was that in New York? Yeah. Oh yeah, because my mom knew that guy. That was in New York. That wasn't in New York City though. Oh, it has to be in the city. Yeah. Did I say New York City or did I say? Yeah, my New mom York? knew the guy. She went to school with the guy who actually killed his family. Wow, that's fucked up. Yeah, it was, <laughs> he's in his. his, his or he's in her yearbook. Yikes. He was like, yeah, he talked to me once, and he was the creepiest little shit. Can you imagine just looking at your book? It's like, oh, 
Did you ever see that movie? He was in it. He was, in it. <laughs> he was that guy. <laughs> she did that. I was like, oh, have you ever heard this horror American horror? Like, American, or, not American horror. I made a, I made a horror, and she's like, yeah, I don't like that movie. And I was like, why? And she's like. Too close to home. <laughs> <laughs> Way too close. Okay. Okay. Um. Well, let's just say that one. Hold Fuck on. it. Okay. Oh. Whatever. Hold on. There should be spooky music in the background. There should be. Can we add spooky music? Oh, fuck off. <laughs> All of a sudden, spooky music. Batman plays in the background. Batman. Oh, wait, no, Coco plays in the background. Coco? That was a good movie. So it's, yeah. We saw that on Saturday. I was thinking. Oh. Oh, shit. Why, oh, okay. I... Yeah, Why did I not that. think of that? That's the worst movie. Friday the 13th, Jason Takes Manhattan. Yeah, it's so bad. It's so I, bad. I, it's I've so only funny. seen like three of Friday the 13th. Uh, I think it was the first four movies I binged on. Uh, Stop It 2. <laughs> Actually, just watch two. I need to watch all of them. <laughs> just just watch two. They're we all, need to they're watch all, all of them really for bad. Our podcast. They're actually so bad. Like, every single horror movie, except... Yeah, they're all bad. Yeah. Well, we still have to watch them. Like, my whole, my whole thing is, like, every single horror movie is bad, but I still like them. Okay. I really like Ghost Ship, and it was, like... I've never bad. seen Ghost Ship. Oh, my God. That was, like, one of my favorites. Emily Browning's in it? Don't know who that is. Well, she was in Sucker Punch. Never seen Sucker Punch. Are you kidding me? And she's also. I haven't seen Sucker Punch either. What? That movie was pretty good too. I like that movie. It I watched like most weird. of it while I was donating plasma. <laughs> oh, but it was subtitled. I really like this. There I was like no this... audio whatsoever. I like the soundtrack too. <laughs> it's like, what are we watching? It was really cool. Like I wanted to be. Um, I forgot a little nickname that they had. Whatever. Uh, he's being asked a question now. Oh yeah. Is it me? Uh, yeah, you, you asked just, him a question. Yeah. No, he just asked me. I just, he just asked. Why are we going in? I don't know. Okay. So right, let's start over. You just asked me, so it's your turn. Wait, okay, let's just go this way. Okay. So. All right, so it's my turn again. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That's why I said it's going to be my yeah, turn. We're going this yeah, way. This is fine. He just asked me fine. a question. <laughs> no, I so. just asked him a question. You I let you ask me. No. no. Done fucked up. <laughs> okay, fine. Because he asked you a question. Okay. He asked so it's your turn again. Okay. Why'd you ask two people questions? <laughs> I don't know. I think Carlos is fucking it up. I don't know what's going on. Okay. <laughs> I'll ask Cody a question, and then... Then he'll ask you a question, and then I'll ask him a question, and then you ask No, me. then you then you'll this ask me a question. You sing as fuck. Ask me. I ask you. You ask you. <laughs> yeah, oh, we just myself. ask. <laughs> you ask yourself. This isn't that hard. <laughs> it's pretty hard. <laughs> Um, these are fucking hard. I don't even know any of these answers. Uh, okay. Oh, I know this. Okay, you might know it. What is the name of the pagan deity that feeds on the souls of children in the movie Sinister? Oh. I tell I always get fucking Sinister, Insidious, and The Conjuring all mixed That's up. They're all basically the same yeah. fucking movie. No. It was, it's, it's confusing, I'm not gonna lie. I totally forgot the name anyway, but I, did too. I know it's the answer. The Is it the nun woman? <laughs> what? It's sinister! That's no, the wait, conjuring. That's, that's insane, wait. That's, that's the conjuring. <laughs> Conjuring is the nun. The nun woman is the conjuring? I thought it was Insidious. Yeah. Nope, Insidious no. is, uh... Which one is Sinister? Insidious... It, it's Bagula. Sinister. Bagula. It's, it's Bagula. Sinister no, Bagula. is the one... It's Bagula, not Bagula. Bagula. Okay. Um, Sinister is the one with the videotapes and the kids who have to kill their family. I thought that was the conjuring. No, the conjuring is the one with <laughs> oh, what the, the fuck? <laughs> conjuring is with those two uh, two people. Like, oh yeah, 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 yeah. Scooby Doo people. <laughs> the Scooby Doo people. It's accurate though. It's true. <laughs> and then instead, he is with the Darth Maul motherfucker. Yeah. Yes. He's only in the first one though. Yeah, he is. He's so. really cool. He's only in that one part. No, he's in like. Well, yeah, it's easy to distinguish if I just remember Darth Maul. True. I always remember, um, what's her face? The old lady. Yeah. The old lady? Oh, it's my yeah. turn? Yeah. Who am I asking? Uh, she was in Nightmare Part 3. Yes, she is. She's a nurse lady with the pills. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she was in Nightmare Part 1. Is that what you just said? No, said part, part 3. She's in 1, too. Is she in 1? In is Friday she in? Oh, wait, what are we talking about? Nightmare, Nightmare. 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 Yeah. yeah. She was a teacher in the first movie. Oh, I need to yeah. rewatch watch that then. I've seen it like five times. I yeah, we should probably that. watch that. Okay, yeah. She has a very forgettable there. face, apparently. Yeah. Okay. Maybe you'll know this. Nosferatu. Nosferatu? 
Nosferatu. Nosferatu. <laughs> was one of the earliest films adaptations of what classic horror novel? Dracula. That's correct. Wow, I totally you got didn't two guess. of them. Whoa. Oh wow, where did my other one go? Right there. Oh, I said it right there. Oh wait, I didn't give Cody any cards. Did oh, he get any sorry. right? <laughs> I don't know, did he? No, he didn't. <laughs> no, he didn't. So he has none. Oh, yeah. What was the first question you asked me? Oh, yeah, I asked you about Base Motel. Oh, yeah. No, that's fine. It's whatever. I don't give a fuck. If I find it you again, can take this one card. It's okay. a blue one. Oh, behind what? the scenes. <laughs> that makes sense. Get this card. Yeah. That makes sense. The slash card. Oh, it's your turn. Is it my turn? Yeah. Yeah, it's your turn to ask me. Category X. What the fuck does that even mean? Uh, Here you go. Bye, Jeffrey. Category X is... Um, it's some nonsense is what it is. <coughs> Fuck. Let's see. Ooh, in what year... <laughs> do you know anything about years? Somewhat. In what year was John Carpenter's The Thing release? The Thing? Um, uh, the 80s version or the 50s version? Is there a 50s version? There's a 50s version? No, there's an 80s version and a 2000s version. Oh, okay. Uh, 1986. I'm gonna say... I'm gonna say 83. I'm gonna say 82. Yeah, I was gonna say 86 or 83. It was 82. I was right. I'll take this card for myself. (laughs) 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 Alright, Cody. Uh... This is the... This is the back. (laughs) You're looking at the answers. (laughs) Not brought you wood. (laughs) <laughs> oh yeah, that's going to be too obvious. Uh, what is the high, highest grossing horror movie remake of all time? Remake? Yeah. Shit. You said it's easy? Oh no, the the one below it is easy. The highest highest gross- grossing? Yeah. I'm going to say The Exorcist. I don't think the remake was... Oh, remake. I thought yeah. I'd go. Yeah. Uh, remake, remake. It was originally Japanese. The Grudge! Re- Ring. It was the ring. Ha! Every time I think about a horror Japanese. I've never seen the Japanese version. Oh, did you see oh. uh, The Ring versus The Grudge? No. Oh, yeah. yeah. That was awesome. That's a thing. Yeah. <laughs> Is it Japanese only? Yeah. Yeah. That's we great. watched it. How's that even the thing? The, the Japanese made it. The it was a very convoluted plot to make yeah. it work. Yeah. But they made it work. It so, what, did they make the Grudge lady watch the movie or something? No, they had, they were like in the same town, and like one girl was being haunted by the grudge woman, and then her friend watched the tape for the ring, and then she was like stuck in between, and they were like fighting over her soul. That's fucking weird. <laughs> yeah. Alright, okay, well that's on my fucking movie list. Who's okay. your, your turn? Yeah, that was pretty easy. Bye. What is the name of the boy who may or may not be the Antichrist in the Omen? Damien. Yep. Yeah. Damien Thorne. Damien, this is for you. This is all for you. That fucked me up as a kid. I know. I saw I saw it in theaters when it came out. Oh, wow. 666. Yeah. The, it is, yeah. Oh, the remake. <laughs> and then I got kicked out of the movie theaters. Why? Because I bought a... I was under 16, I guess, when that movie came out. Really? So, they didn't card you, though? No, I bought tickets to... Uh, what did I see? It was some kid movie. Oh, and then so you went into the... But then I just ended up sneaking back in. <laughs> Such a rebel. Is it my turn? Yeah. Or Cody's turn? Oh, it's your turn. You come after me. No, I don't know. You just ask me? Uh, no, because I just asked him. I just asked uh, what year the thing came out. Yeah, that he would. Yeah. Okay. Then I asked about fucking ring. Yeah. Okay, I don't know. This one seems pretty hard. Horror can show up in unexpected places, like the clan of sodomizing hillbillies in this 1972 film. House of Eyes. Yeah, I was gonna say that too. No. Or. Oh, I know this one. I never seen it though. Oh, fucking. Deliverance. You got it. (gasps) Oh man, I actually never saw that one. I didn't either. (laughs) I remember watching a top ten disturbing scenes, and it was that movie is like raping that's what happened in the hills of ice well there's a guy raping another guy oh I don't know 
I guess that's scary. <laughs> I mean, I guess that's pretty scary. Fucked up. Pretty scary. All right, name four horror movies about parasites or parasitic organisms. Uh, oh, that's the anime of Sl- Slither? Oh, Slither. Um, alien. Thing. Can I say alien too? <laughs> yeah. No sequels. <laughs> no sequels. True. Uh, body snatchers. Oh, is that? No, it's not parasites. Bugs. Would um. I don't know if that's even. Well, the. Clowns from outer space be a one. Killer clowns from outer space. Yeah. Are they parasites? They're like alien They're... type things. Are they? Would that be? Mm-hmm. Uh, does the anime parasite count? That's how I was like, that's the only thing I can think of when I said parasite. Yeah, parasite. Yeah. Uh, does it specify movies? Yes, it specifies movies, so no, it yeah. does not count. Okay. Um. Mm. Parasites. Uh. I don't know. Oh, you have? Or three? I think I have three. Yep. And how many? Two more? One more. Um. Godzilla. He's not a parasite. You wouldn't know. Um. I don't know. Pass. I give up. No, I don't. I know there's gotta be. <laughs> I never seen that. No. Before. There's three of those. Is that tricky? Have a chainsaw? Yes. Yes. Holy shit. If you're not, if you're wondering what we're looking at, we're looking at Thanks Killing and Thanks Killing 3. I couldn't find two for the life of me. I don't think there is a two. I think there is an IMDb. Oh, okay. The Evil Dead. That counts as a parasite, right? Yeah, oh. technically. Oh, okay. Well, fuck it. Okay. We got four of them. Let's go. Is it my turn? Or your turn? It's my turn. This is really hard to keep track of. It goes in a circle. It's not that hard. It's pretty complicated. <laughs> Apparently everything's complicated. Prior to becoming a Ghostbuster, what was Dr. Peter Venkman's field of study? Which one is Venkman? I need to watch Ghostbusters. Venkman. Uh, theoretical physics. What do you say? Uh, exorcist man. <laughs> I haven't seen Parapsychology. Wow, that was not even close. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not psychology. That's not science. <laughs> science, damn he didn't it. didn't say science. He said field of study. The question is, what was his field of study? Mm. And I just, well, I don't think after some of these is science. I don't know anything about science. You know anything about anything? Uh, I, I know some things. Like, he knows uh, how to read a heart monitor. Exactly. <laughs> but uh, I wouldn't trust myself with your life. <laughs> Everybody trusts you with their life. <laughs> yeah. Don't. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> okay, this one's easy. In the Evil Dead, 1981, what is the name of the Book of the Dead that Ash and company find in the basement of their cabin? Come on. Everyone knows this. Or are you asking me? I'm asking whoever wants to say yeah, it. It's the Necronomicon. Okay. <laughs> I didn't know the name of the book. Boo. You didn't know the name of the I Necronomicon. Didn't know the <laughs> <laughs> Have you seen the old dead? The new one? The old ones? No. What? You're so funny. Oh, well, actually, I lied. Um, I saw half of the first one, and then I remember the first half of um, the Dead Army one. Like, I like... The first one, and then the second one is basically just like a shitty remake of the first one. Wait, what are we talking about? The Evil, Evil Dead. Dead. Oh. Nah, I like the second one better than the first one. Well, it's like, I'm just saying it's like basically the same movie. Yeah, it is. <laughs> but it's funnier. It is. Uh, what horror classic was filmed mostly on location at the Monroeville Mall in Monroeville, Pennsylvania? Pennsylvania. A mall? Yeah. Was it uh, Dawn of the Dead? Yeah. Oh. I just think of the uh, Dead Rising. Because Dead Rising was based on that movie, right? True. Probably, yeah. Okay. Horror can show up at unexpected places, like the Kali Ma human sacrifice scene from this 1984 uh, Raiders of the Lost Ark. 
Yes. No. No? No. It's any of the Jones movie. Yes. Uh. Uh. Oh, I know it's Raiders of the Lost Ark. Oh, wait, wait. Uh. Come on. Crystal Skull. No, nope. it was Skull before that. Crystal Lake. Eight, 1984. No, it's Crystal Lake. Indian uh, Jones and the Crystal Lake. Oh, God. The Tomb of. I don't know. I. I've never seen any Indiana like, Jones movies. What? Yeah. I just know, like, the parodies. That little Asian boy. You guys is, there, is there an Asian kid in that Dr. movie? Dr. Tran? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Dr. Tran. I don't know. I forget the name of the movie. You guys give up? Wait. Uh, Raiders of the Lost Ark. I already said that. <laughs> <laughs> is that the only one you guys know? Yes. Yeah. So you guys give up? I give up. Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. Oh, Temple of Doom. That was Doom. close. That was close. No one gets that card. You were close. I get half a point. <laughs> you're saying Then Indiana you would Jones. get half a point, too, because he gets it the same fucking <laughs> movie. Uh, yeah, but I said it first. <laughs> okay, quarter point to you. Quarter. <laughs> point you bet. Uh, name. Let's see. This is the same fucking... That's weird. Okay, name two horror films that take place in Japan. Ah! The Grudge. <laughs> the Grudge and the Ring. <laughs> Actually, well, I guess the All right, no Ryan American Japan. versions. No American versions? No, I mean only American. Only American versions? Ring took place in, like, fucking Nevada and fucking the American version, right? Bingo and yeah. Gojira. But the grudge did turn did even the American version the grudge took place in Japan. So the grudge, yeah, that's so counts. But not the ring. No, the ring took place in like fucking. I said Ringu, Ringu. which is the Japanese version of it. This, this is America. <laughs> this is America. Okay, so Japanese movies that are also horror that take place in Japan. Sumo, yeah. Also Godzilla. <laughs> <laughs> no, Godzilla takes place in New York. Yeah, <laughs> the one that was made here. No, not not the uh, 2017 version. That wasn't in Japan, was it? There were some scenes that were in Japan. Oh, was Godzilla in Japan in those scenes? No, he was mostly in, like, Hawaii. And yeah, Las so Vegas. that doesn't count. So that doesn't count. <laughs> mm, it's pretty hard. This is weirdly specific. Japan. What happens in Japan? Nothing. I mean, a lot of things, but nothing that... Oh, my God. <laughs> Uh, uh, grudge, you said? Yeah. I'm glad to look. Oh no, I lost the card. No, it's okay. What does it say? I mean, I'll read it. <laughs> I give up. I can only think of the grudge. Hmm. Okay, what well, says ring you? Okay. See? But you said American. Well, it doesn't say the American one. Okay, he just added it. It just says ring you. Yeah, it said ring you. Okay. No, I get half a point. No, fuck and you. And you get half a point. Fuck up and die. <laughs> wow, rude. <clears throat> oh, shit. Silence. Okay, uh, what Academy Award nominated actor played Beto Geese? And Tim Burton's Beetlejuice. Uh, Valdemar Kilmer. <laughs> That's not his name, is it? <laughs> Valdemar Kilmer? <laughs> what the fuck is his name? He's, um, he's Batman, right? Yeah. 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 Wasn't that his name? Something like no. that? No. Eric Killmonger. <laughs> Who? Putin. That's the main antagonist in Black Panther. Oh, I was like, what the fuck? Oh, yeah, it's, uh... Oh, my God! Fat. I knew he's him! The one that, he's on the one that got fat, right? Mm-hmm. Isn't it Val... Isn't it Kilmar? Some Kilmar? Not Val Kilmer. Oh, is it Val it's Kilmer? Not, nope. It's not him. George Clooney. Mm-hmm. No, it's the other Batman. How many Batman? Uh, Christian Bale. No! <laughs> <laughs> I can't ben use Affleck? my phone! <laughs> Oh my god! I had I was thinking of his name like the other day. No. I think it's the Is it the Riddler Batman? That has this actor in it? No, that's Valkomer. Is it the I'm one the, sure. the one with Joker? Where is it? No, I think it's the one with the Joker. Like the one before the Riddler one. 
The one where he can't turn his head. Why did Tim Burton direct two Batman movies? Who let Tim Burton direct two Batman movies? <laughs> I liked his Batman movies as a kid, and I still enjoy them today, so I don't give a shit. He didn't direct Batman and Robin, did he? No, he wrote it. He produced it. He I produced think. Batman and Robin? I think so, yeah. Nah, he can go die. Uh, wow. That's, that's my favorite one. <laughs> Why? It's like uh, when fucking Arnold Schwarzenegger's... He's like... You guys need to chill. <laughs> Racism. Chill. You know I killed the ice age. Or you know I killed the dinosaurs. The ice age. Yeah. Oh. I think he's still alive. Oh god. I can't believe he's still making Terminator movies. You give up? I give up. Yeah. It's Michael Keaton. Michael fucking shit. Damn it. Oh my it. god. I know his name. Just not Apparently not. <laughs> His name was in my memory banks. <laughs> Just not where I needed it. You guys want to know any of those? Try me. Alright. <clears throat> I really just fan fanatic, excuse me, commits a series of murders in order to slay demons with the help of his two young sons in this 2001 film. Film. Supernatural. <laughs> That's what I thought too. <laughs> it's supernatural. 2001 film. Ah, oh, fuck. I actually watched this while we uh, lived at the house. You watched a little bit with me. Can you repeat the question? <laughs> a religious fanatic commits a series of murders in order to slay demons with the help of his two young sons in this 2001 film thank you Mo. cricket cricket yeah I don't know frailty what oh. frailty never heard of it never heard of it yeah I didn't um, my mom actually um, was talking about it and that's why I downloaded it that day and then I watched it and it was uh, I think I forgot who was in it. I want to say Ryan Gosling, but I don't remember. Um, it was pretty good. I liked it. Okay, name two horror movies with America or American in the title, besides American Psycho. America, America. I'm Vito. Oh. American Psycho. Unless those are the only movies. Only films. Watch. Yeah. Does God bless America count? No, I've never seen it. Oh. But American Psycho isn't even on this list of answers. Huh. Uh, American Werewolf in London. There you go. Fucking. I think this one's on Netflix or was. Can you give us a hint? Hmm? Can you give us a hint? Uh. Mary's in the name. <laughs> that should be your biggest hint. Mary? Mm-hmm. Marry me in America. Marry America. Give up. I'll marry you, Kyle. <laughs> <laughs> See what you did there. <laughs> I give up. I don't know. American Mary. She just said American in front of it. <laughs> I've never heard of that one. I think it's, uh... I was gonna say, like, Rosemary's Baby 2. Back to America. Or <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, these are all numbered. You can put them in order. Wow. Name three ways in which Michael Myers has been killed. He's been Fire. shot. Run over. Drowned. He's been drowned. When he was a kid. No. That's that's the, Jason Voorhees. Oh God damn it! He fucked up. They <laughs> <laughs> shot. Uh, decapitated. He, he yeah, he was actually. Yeah. In H two O. And then he came back for the sequel somehow. Didn't he get lit on fire? That's also Jason Voorhees. God damn it! I need to watch Halloween more. <laughs> so was it? You said two or three? Three. And I got shot. Decapitated. Decapitated. Pretty sure he was run. He was run over in the first one. Oh yeah. Look what. I thought he was shot in the first one. Oh, yeah, I think he was shot. Or maybe I'm thinking of the remake. No, I'm totally... I, no, I think he was... Run, well, it's one of them. Did he explode in the hospital? 
we turn the hat wheel over. Right. Yeah, burn in the hospital. Ha! So he, burned, he got burned. Yeah. So you get on fire. Fuck you guys. <laughs> I was specific. Whatever. It's my turn. Oh, not the sour cream. <laughs> Name one move, one horror movie about a killer inanimate object. I can already think of it. Cujo. Inanimate <laughs> object. Uh, pervert. Inanimate object. A penis is an inanimate object if you cut it off of someone. <laughs> Piranha. That's a fish. <laughs> yeah. and then Rubber. Oh, the car movie? The fucking tire that kills people! I think mine still counts. Christine? I tricked my mom into watching Rubber, and I was like, yeah, it's one of the best horror movies of this year. And she watched it, she's like, what the fuck did you make me watch? I found a destination. <laughs> Inanimate objects? Yeah, someone got killed by a freaking roller coaster, elevator, Log. wood logs. Exactly. Okay. I still think mine counts. <laughs> Fine, your penis movie counts. <laughs> your turn. I was like, stop motion cock monster. What's the name of that movie? <laughs> oh, yeah. What is the name of the chainsaw wielding maniac in the Texas Chainsaw Massacre? Leatherface. Sure. What's his real name? I think there's two different names. I don't know. I know it's. James Hewlett? Yeah, Thomas, I Thomas that. Hewlett? Yeah. I just remember the actual guy. He, uh, pretty he sure portrays. The, so, I'm pretty sure the 74 version is a different name, though. But it was the other face. The fucking... I don't even know that. Huh. Uh, where does Nightmare on Elm Street take place? <clears throat> like the name of the city. Oh. Town. <laughs> um. On Oak Street. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, what was the question? Uh, oh my god. <laughs> uh, me, what's the name of the town where a Nightmare on Elm Street takes place? Uh, Springfield? Close. Springwood. 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 Oh, okay. Ha! Ah. I knew it. So these are um, clues about the movie. A book? A chainsaw and a broomstick. Sorry, what? A brook, book, a chainsaw, and a broomstick. Evil Dead. Close. I'm in darkness. Yes. Oh, there you go. Oh, you said broomstick. Broom. Wait, does it say boom or broom? It says broom? boomstick. Oh. <laughs> if it said boomstick, I would have been like, oh, Evil Dead. Or Army of Darkness. Uh, I'm bad. Oh. I can't fucking read. No, broomstick. I'm just like, Fantasia? <laughs> Fantasia doesn't have a chainsaw in it. Uh, Fantasia's actually an answer on one of these cards. <clears throat> Dumbo's an answer on one of them, too. So, so is Bambi. These are the pink elephants. Uh, my turn? Yeah. Oh, shit. Yes. Shit. Mm. Name four horror movies that feature evil parents. Evil parents? Um, does the gate count? Because, like, demons tricked him into thinking his parents were back. And then they, like, squished his eyes. <laughs> I've never seen the gate, so I don't know. Oh my god, the gate, the gate was pretty cool. Evil parents. Uh, I can't really even think of one. Unless you consider it somewhat. I wouldn't wouldn't say they're evil, though. I mean, her dad was. Yeah. He was like a big creeper. And it's that one of the movies you said earlier. Really? It's on there? Not not the gate. Oh. It was one we didn't know. We didn't know? Fragility? Fragility? Oh, yeah, fragility. Frailty? Frailty. <laughs> fragility. <laughs> Good enough. <laughs> uh, you guys go up? Desperado. <laughs> no. I don't know. Well, I guess. Okay, they, fine. Uh, Friday the 13th. Oh, yeah. Oh. Duh. 
Stepfather. House of Wax. Stepfather? Yeah. House of Wax. I haven't heard of it. Me either. House uh, of Wax. Uh, I haven't seen that movie since 2006. So good. The only reason I like really like it is because of what's his face in it. Paris Hilton? No. His face. That's a remake, right? Yeah. Yeah. And then My Chemical Romance plays at the end of the credits. <laughs> I hate that uh, Achilles tendon part. Oh my god, yeah, I can't watch that part. I cannot watch that part. Apple. Nope. My back. Uh, a group of medical students go on a ski trip and wind up having to fight Nazi zombies in this 2009 film. Nazi zombies? Yeah. Hmm. There's only one that I can think of, and it's the correct answer. Alright. Uh, I remember the one where, like, the Nazis are on the dark side of the moon, but I forgot what that was called. <laughs> uh, Wolfenstein. <laughs> oh, Iron Sky. What? Iron Sky. Oh, Wolfenstein has uh, uh, Nazis and. No, it was called Iron Sky. Sure. That's not the answer to the question. No, I know, but I was thinking the movie. Um, Dead Snow or something. Yeah, like it's Dead Snow. Yeah. Oh shit! They're, they're yeah. on the moon. Yeah. I no. didn't watch that, but I saw it. <laughs> <laughs> no, oh, Iron so Sky. On the moon. Iron Sky shit. is the one where we thought like our military was like there's got to be something different or like somebody somebody like saw a. Nazi or something, and they're all like, we found uh, something, and they we figured out that they're on the dark side of the moon. They have a camp, and they just haven't turned the moon in forever. <laughs> what? The? Yeah. I guess. That and then they I'm go pretty to the sure moon. scientists would notice that. <laughs> and then they go to the moon, and they have like a big camp set up, and it's just a bunch of Nazis. They're like, we're complete or come back. And I was like, what the fuck? Like I thought it was gonna be really cool, and it was not cool at all. It was horrible I mean, acting. Nazis in space kind of sounds lame. <laughs> <laughs> well, I thought it was gonna be cool. I didn't were know it was gonna be on the roof. Were, were they aliens? Gonna... Read the next no. question. I. Oh, or... it is mine. It's yeah, mine. it's your turn. Okay. Awkward silence. There's a lot of awkward silence. Uh... That's because someone needs to pick a damn question like every five seconds. <laughs> Where's the background music? What background music? Wait, I got, I got, I got background music. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. You gotta plug your band. Which cast <laughs> member of NBC's <laughs> The Office met his demise in The House of a Thousand Corpses? Uh, Steve Carell. No. What? Can you reread the question? Oh, it was, Wait, a, it's it was a, Jim. Jim. Yeah, I was gonna say it was Jim. No. Yeah, it is. No. <laughs> uh, Dwight. Rain Wilson, yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's why I got confused with. I haven't seen House of a Thousand Corpses since like 2007, 2008. I have never seen it, and I need to watch it. It's pretty okay. I saw half of it. That was the one where Zob- Rob Zombie directed, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. It actually another one. I forgot what it was. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> <That's okay. laughs> <laughs> have you heard his songs? No, I thought it was just a fucking cat. There's songs? Yeah, it's just called Vitus. This one's dumb. Oh. They're great. Look them up. <laughs> YouTube them. Uh, that's fucking easy peasy. Name three of the Universal Studios movie monsters. Wolfman. Actually, fuck that. Name five. Wolfman. Uh, the uh, from Black, Black Lagoon. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Frankenstein. Yeah. Invisible Man. Yeah. Frankenstein's white. The Red Frankenstein. Oh, I guess. The Mummy? The Mummy. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Three's too easy. Let's make it five. We live in, we live in Florida. We've Fuck, been make through... it ten. <laughs> make it twenty. We went to that horror movie thing in, um, in Universal. Mm-hmm. I really like that thing. That was pretty cool. My turn? Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay. Burp, burp. Ooh, you guys won't know what this would. Try. Don't. What controversial found footage film was the second highest? 
was the second highest grossing movie in 1983 in Japan. That's behind <laughs> only E.T. the Extraterrestrial. In book. Japan? <laughs> Japan is that they had horror movies in the 80s? <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit. Lost footage. Uh, uh, it's not Blair White. All right. Blair, Blair White. White. <laughs> Blair White. Uh, it's not Blair Witch. Uh, fucking. What found footage movies came before Blair Witch? I didn't know there was. I, thought, I literally thought Blair Witch was like the first one. Same. Is it wreck? No, that wasn't. Quarant? No. It's not quarantine. This is actually, um, while I was playing uh, Life is Strange, they actually mentioned this. Warren, her little friend, mentioned it in the beginning, but you probably weren't playing Is that the game with the cat? It's a whole world, though. Huh? Is that the game with the cat? Uh, there hasn't been a cat yet, I don't think. Oh. This is about, like, she can uh, turn back time. Okay, I'm definitely different. Thing that Horrible. <laughs> uh, Horrible. Wait, is it Tokyo School Police? Tokyo Drift. <laughs> <laughs> they all die if they come back to right, the you, Okay, do you go? Yeah, sure. Cannibal Holocaust. Oh, oh wow. Holocaust. That, was, that, was, that was made in Japan? Yeah. Huh. Well, it was high church moving in Japan. Huh. It wasn't made in Japan. Oh. That's not what I would expect from Japan. <laughs> I was about to say, what the... Wow. You want Japan, don't ya? Wait, how's he say? Wow. <laughs> wow. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, wow. Where's the lightsaber when we need it? Uh, it's probably at Scott's house. Yeah, probably. Wow. It's like fucking sunglasses. It's your fault. Yikes. Ha, 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 ha. In what year was Jaws released? 19... 1983? 1970. I think it was the 70s. I want to say 76. Or 81. 79? 75. 75. I was almost right. Wow. I said 76. Wow. 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 <laughs> also, we're going to do a lot of memes. Oh, wow. Jaws. Fun fact. Memes, let's was only in the movie for 13 minutes. <laughs> yeah. That was actually the one movie that scared the audiences a lot. Oh, yeah. That's right. There was also um, the reading of World War, War of the Worlds. Um, do you remember, remember that movie with Tom Cruise and his father? And it was awful. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Um, they had a radio reading. Was just yes, came we out. all know the story. Everyone thought it was real for some stupid reason. Yeah, and everybody started freaking out. Because everyone from the fucking 80s is retarded. <laughs> <laughs> you know, oh you want to know something funny about Jaws? Have you seen all the Jaws? Not all of them. Okay, well. I see one and two. Uh, what was it? Jaws 3 takes place in uh, Florida at SeaWorld. Really? Yeah. yeah. And sad. if you ever, like, go. Because it's Jaws 3D. It was originally Jaws 3D. Have you you been to SeaWorld, right? Not since I was like four. Not since I was like 14. Well, like there's like a, you've been to the shark exhibit? Yeah. If you go like at end, the end of it, it's like, you can hold like 10 elephants on this glass and it won't break. It's because of Jaws 3. They, they had to put that because <laughs> the giant shark crashed through the shark <laughs> exhibit. And it freaked people out. Yeah. <laughs> and then Jaws, the revenge, this is literally a shark going after a family. It's pretty dumb. Like, it's just following a family? Yeah, because, like, yeah, it's the, pretty awful. the... Fr- you didn't give me enough fish, bitch! <laughs> See, the lady on the thing, uh, her son killed Jaws number one, so I guess Jaws number four. I don't know, it's fucking weird. Like, the shark follows him all the way to Hawaii or something. Jesus Christ! <laughs> it's fucking weird. Or to the Bahamas. I think it's the Bahamas. Revenge! <laughs> <laughs> it's really oh bad. my god. But, uh, the butler... From Batman's in it. Which one? All of them. Christian Bale. Batman. Oh, okay. Uh, what horror film series features a mask inspired by a famous Edvard Munch painting? A mask? Yeah. Is a series? Yeah, horror film series. A mask? A mask. Jason? No. Friday the 13th? <laughs> Michael Myers? No. That was William Shatner it was inspired by. It. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's spray painted. Yeah. A mask. It was at the mask too. But uh 
while the movie is horrifying, no, no, it is not. <laughs> what the? What? That was so cool. The mask? No, 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 mask too. With the, uh, what the fuck's his name? He was like, was it was it David Spade? No, not David Spade. Oh, the other white guy that looked like Jim Carrey. No, it wasn't Jim. No, the mask was oh, Jim Carrey. Yeah, we're talking the about other mask white, too. the two one was horrible. Mask. Where they put the mask on the wait? Did on they the put dog. the mask on the dog? Yeah. yeah, they put the mask on the baby. Yeah, that too. That was terrifying. Terrifying. Just I, terrifying. I give up. Wait, wait. What was the mask? Mask. Who the hell wears a mask? I don't know. I can't think of anything. Uh, one of the members of the Wu Tang Clan has the mask. Ghostface. Together. Yeah. There you go. Scream. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Ghostface killer. Ghostface killer, y'all. Uh. Wu Tang forever. You did it wrong. That's an M for one. <laughs> <laughs> That's also West Side. <laughs> and you're about to get shot. Ooh. Damn. Well, I probably should do this in public. <laughs> Let's see. How does Chucky come back to life at the start of Child's Plays 2? Child's Play 2? Ugh. Child's Play 2. I haven't seen that movie since like 99. Lightning strike, I don't know. Uh, he, he's brought back by his girlfriend? Is that, or is that the third one? That's the third one. I don't even know if she's breaking back. Uh, the third one, I think, yeah, is when the girl from Marie came back. Uh, you know, I saw a cult with Chucky, like, two weeks ago. A cult? The cult, the, the newest child to play movie. Oh, I haven't seen that one. It's okay. It's not really. I think I've seen The Bride of Chucky either. I think that is the third one. Um, is that the fourth one? No, I thought that was the first one. No, he's, he gets brought, brought back by Voodoo. That's how he That's the first one. Yes, yeah, second time. Nation is one, two. Second time. Bride, true. seed, ah. cult. I think. Did I bring him up? Yeah, I don't give a fuck. The Pay Play Pals Toy Factory rebuilds him as a publicity stunt to assure the customers that nothing's wrong with their dolls. Wow. Whoops. Burm, burm, burm. <laughs> that was way off. <laughs> They're done fucked up. Uh, fuck. Uh, name two horror movies that begin with the letter U. Under the sea. <laughs> oh, I saw this movie. It's pretty bad. Um, I guess Under the Skin could be considered a horror movie. The tattoo one? But it's boring. The tattoo one? Is that the one? Under the Skin? Uh, no, that's the one with Jennifer Lawrence, and she goes around killing men as, like, an alien. Oh, yeah. It's not Jennifer Lawrence. Isn't it? Oh, no, it's uh, Charlotte Johansson. Johansson. Yeah. And it's super boring. Oh, my God. <laughs> Dante fell asleep. I left the room. <laughs> <laughs> I tried really hard to watch it. <laughs> oh, no. I think it was, like, an art project or something. Is that what Dante said? I don't know. Like, her friend did it, and they asked her to, and she's like, yeah. And it yeah, anything else? Um, you. Umbrella. Ella. Ella. Bad. <laughs> I don't know. Under the something, probably. Oh, well, the two examples they had were Unnameable, which I've never seen. Mm-hmm. And then Unfriended, which came out. Oh, yeah. Ago. That's fucking... That was bad. Yeah. I thought it was okay. But you can talk about Unfriended. <laughs> uh, it was yeah, no. <laughs> That's the one where... Uh, that where all she, takes place on webcams. Yeah. Yeah, she killed herself, and then she comes back to haunt her on the, like, year anniversary. Right, like, right. Oh, you were there, and you laughed at my death? Fuck you, I'm gonna put your head in a blender. And, yeah, there's another one called Final Quest, right? Yeah. I didn't see that one. You know, it was an alright movie. Um, That one about Ooh. the demon thing that follows the person after they have sex with them? It follows? Yeah, it follows. Yeah, uh, it was okay. It was pretty good. It yeah. was it was different from the other horror movies that we've I'm, I'm used to at least. My friend told me to check it out, so I was like, I'll watch it. 
and like it only had like three stars on Netflix, and I was like, I'll still watch it. Right. Name, you uh, know, the stars aren't ratings. Name four horror movies oh. that begin with the letter E. 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 Uh. E- Enchanted. <laughs> horror movie. Uh, Elephant. Elephant. Is that the one with Columbine kids? What? Elephant. Oh. That sounds familiar. I don't know though. Uh, uh, horror movies that start with E. Horror movies that start. I didn't say cheat on your phone. I said look up elephant on your phone. That's what I'm doing. You typed in horror movies that start with E. I could just not do that. <laughs> What'd your phone say, Carlos? What'd your phone say, Carlos? <laughs> horror movies that start with E. No, it says point hub. Big anime titties. <laughs> I was just talking about big anime titties. Eating alive. Hey, Lego freaks. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot about that one. And all these movies I still have not seen. Eraser Get Head. <laughs> Ooh. Event yeah. Horizon. The Evil Dead. Evil Dead. Evil Dead. The Exorcist. 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 Wow. <laughs> wow, we suck. Wow. 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 <laughs> the eyes have hills. <laughs> 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 I'm looking. Uh, name two horror movies starring Jack Nicholson. Jack Shining. Nicholson? Yeah, Shining. Yeah. Um, Batman. <laughs> Batman. Yeah. The Shining and Wolf. I've never seen Wolf. Wolf. I've never heard of it. <laughs> no. Is Jack Nicholson some do shit? He better. He's amazing. Yeah. Excuse me? Um... Uh, you want beef at 10 o'clock? What time is it? Time to get a fucking lunch. How long have we been talking for? Like an uh, hour. Why should I be recording? Oh my god. <laughs> no, it is. <laughs> yeah, it's been like an hour and 20, like 11 minutes. How long do podcasts go for? They go forever. Depends on how long you want it to be. Some are 30 minutes, some are like 4 hours. <laughs> Epic history is like 4 hours long. The uh, rap battles? Oh, no. <laughs> I rap battles poster. Uh, no one would watch it if ooh. each one was over four hours long. <laughs> that is true. These suck. Oh. You guys don't know this movie. I know what question I'll get. That's cool. Uh, <laughs> Name three horror movies that feature a cabin in the woods. Cabin, cabin in the woods. woods. Yeah. Evil Dead, Evil Dead 2. Easy piece. No sequels. <laughs> Ah, no sequels, yeah. yeah. Fuck you. And, uh... Was it oh. Strangers? Wasn't that just a house? Was it? I remember there being a lot of woods. <laughs> I think there was a wood. Um, would, um... Fargo count? Because they were in a cabin by a lake in the woods. I don't think that's a horror movie. It's more of a crime thriller. Mm. What about that movie with the deaf girl? Oh, yeah, with the one I'm talking about. That was in a right. cabin. Yeah, there you go. That was a house. That was a house. It's still in the woods. <laughs> it says specifically cabin in three horror movies that feature a cabin. Wait, would Halloween? Not Halloween. No. Uh, Friday the Thirteenth, because they go to the cabins at the lake, and it's in the woods. Technically, yeah, I guess. Ha ha ha! Or had a uh, I would oh, boy. Cabin Fever. Oh, yeah, cabin cabin fever. fever. I forgot about that. Your turn. Thank you, bitch. We should have recorded this while we were watching the movie. We should have. We talked a lot during the movie. <laughs> Alright, fine. What is the address of Nancy's house in A Nightmare on Elm Street? 1428 Elm Street. There you go. <laughs> I was like, dang, I thought that was hard. <laughs> <laughs> was that right? Yeah. Nice. That's why I gave it to you, dumbass. <laughs> okay. A scientist and his team stay at an allegedly haunted mansion in order to prove the existence of ghosts which leads to madness and death in this 1963 film. Haunted Mansion featuring Eddie Murphy. No. House on House Hill. No. House Conjuring. No. <laughs> uh, I sorry, 1983? 1963. 63. 63. Actually, I haven't seen this version, but I've seen the remake of it, and remake? I loved it. Yeah. You sure it's not the House on House Hill? Positive. I love the house on a hill, and I have that. How many people for? I don't have, uh, the, rem- I don't have the original, but I like the original as well. 60s. You mean it? 
Uh, it's my house. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Good. About ghosts. Um, Ghostbusters, 1985. Oh my God. <laughs> it's about ghosts. They actually just... No, not in the 80s. And, uh... I give up. Give up? The Haunting. Never seen The Haunting. Is that the one Liam Nielsen? That's the remake of it. Yeah. I like the remake. Never seen the remake. Yeah. Pretty remake, pretty good. We should watch it. I've never uh-huh. seen. We should have like camp out night and we just watch horror movies like all night. Don't do that. We can we can podcast those. <laughs> okay. That's too easy. Oh, that's super easy. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's super easy. I don't know who any of these people are. There's three easy questions on this one card. Yeah, some of these are just like plain insane. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's back to my knowledge, dude. I know, I was just like, I'm just gonna read all these so I just like know everything. No. Uh. How am I still taking Let's see. Oh, fuck me. What? I've never. I don't know if I wasn't on the phone. Movies from the 40s? Uh, I don't know who I... Okay. Nope. Okay. What Golden Girl actress played Miss Dolores Bickerman in Lake Placid? The older one. Yeah, which... The taller one. What's her name? Uh... Wait, Betty White. Yep. <laughs> cool. I was not paying attention at all. <laughs> Fine. I just heard Lake Placid. I was like, what? I have, I have three that I really want to read. Three of them. Alright, I have to pick a question. Can I read through mine? Nah. Yeah, gonna do. Wait, what? I got a demon drawing all through. <laughs> you have demons through. How many people does Jason Voorhees kill in Friday the 13th uh, Part 3? How many? 15. Yeah. Let's see, Part 3. 6. 2. 3. three. Five. Nine. No. Seven. Stop guessing numbers. You lose. It's twelve. I was gonna say twelve next. Sucks. <laughs> Can I read three questions? Sure. Whatever. Okay. First question. What was the first horror film to be nominated for These nuts? Best Picture <laughs> at the Academy Awards, receiving a total of ten nominations? Uh, Silence of the Lambs. Hannibal. Is there a year associated with it? Nope. Do you read the question again until I forgot what it is? Uh, I mean, what horror movie got 10 nominations for Best Picture? The Exorcist? Yes. Okay, one <laughs> down. What is the name of the cannibalistic doctor in Silence of the Lambs? Cannibal Lecter. <laughs> and a reporter listens to a vampire tell his story of his life and undeath in this interview 1984 with the film. Interview, interview with the vampire. Well, anniversary of the damned, is that what you said? Anniversary of the damned. Edward Scissorhands. Edward Scissorhands. A combination of Queen of the Damned and Interview with the Vampire. <laughs> hey, can you bring me a pizza roll? I was going to bring some more. Come here, give me the plate. Bring me a fat blunt. <laughs> <laughs> 620 YOLO. I mean 420. <laughs> <laughs> I meant the 669 and 420. I got that. Uh, Mom, I am thirsty though. My back. Or my leg. I guess I'll read a question since you guys are all the way over there. Okay. What horror movie monster was almost named Josh? <laughs> 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 That's pretty bad. I kind of want to make a horror Monster? movie now. It's I don't know. Like, oh no, it's Frank. <laughs> oh no, it's Todd. I didn't know this, so. Uh, creature of the Black Lagoon. <laughs> it's okay, it's Josh. <laughs> I have no idea. Jason. Well, Jason for he screen water changed the name because he thought Josh sounded too nice. <laughs> it does sound too nice. <laughs> huh. this, this is dumb. Next. Uh, 
Like all burnt pieces. Uh, name five horror comedies. Shaun of the Dead. Yep. Um, Evil Dead. John Tucker Must Die. Not Evil Dead 1. Evil Dead 2. Yeah. I'm in Darkness. That's in the same category. Oh. It's um, a sequel. Um. Bombman. Uh, Cabin, the, uh, Cabin in the Woods. John Dad's at the end. Yes. I don't remember John Dad's at the end. Is that more comedy? Yeah, I think so. I think I read the Motion Sense. The End of the World? Huh? The End of the World? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Film movie with oh, James Franco. Yeah. Why do you think I got a new drink, you idiot? You you done fucked up. I didn't know you got a new drink. I said I was going to get up to get a drink like five minutes ago. I didn't listen to you. He was was right next to you. He was getting a drink. (laughs) It fits perfectly into this Taco Bell cup. (laughs) I think it's your drink. Not a sponsor. Not yet. Hmm. A lot of questions. These guys who made this game are pretty thorough. Hmm. Or they did a lot of googling. Most <laughs> filmmakers use corn, red corn syrup to sim, simulate, excuse me, blood, but not Alfred Hitchcock. What substance did he use for the blood in Psycho? Uh, chocolate. Goat blood. This. You, you're almost. You're kind of close. Syrup. Chocolate syrup. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I know this. <laughs> Goat blood. I know this was kind of awesome. How are you guys enjoying this? This is pretty fun. How many people die? Did for, how many people did Freddy Krueger kill in Nightmare on Elm Street? Part, part one. Part one. Uh, um, not that many. Five. I think three or four. Pick one. Four. Four. Wow! I hate that number, and I guessed it. <laughs> Who did my cards like this? Did you do this? I don't know. Why? Why are there no alien ones? Probably a hard <laughs> I don't mean Alien, the movie franchise, but like just based on aliens in general. I put them up for a reason. That's too obvious. In New York, a Vietnam veteran attempts to maintain his sanity as he experiences increasingly frightening visions and delusions in this 1990 film. Wait, what? A Vietnam vet, Scary Visions, 1990s film. <laughs> uh, New York City. Pearl Harbor. Not, not New York City, just New York. <laughs> I know either of you have seen this. I haven't even seen this. Why'd you ask that question? <laughs> Fuck you, that's why. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Check the ladder. Oh, shit. Oh, I actually haven't seen that, yeah. That's a classic. And Guys, I've... I think I think we're we'll gonna have to take a, a little break for this one because it's gonna be really tough. Name three horror movies in which the killer wears a mask. <laughs> Scream, Friday the Thirteenth, and uh, Halloween. Uh, I was I was gonna say Texas Chainsaw because I feel like it doesn't get enough love. <laughs> True. Have you seen Le- the new Leatherface? The new oh the new one. The new, like, new one. His nah. backstory. Yeah, I heard it got like a. 2.5 I'm not surprised <laughs> they bad. do a lot of stuff with them, like Texas Chainsaw just like like Halloween and Friday the 13th and shit and I just I get so bored with it have you guys seen any of the Jeepers Creepers movies oh yeah Jeepers yeah. Creepers was a bomb right. the third one is like on Netflix I saw it was on Netflix today yeah my mom was like really excited but it was bad <laughs> well she likes them a lot um, I like the second one and that's all I go for and then I really then I I guess it yeah, I think the second one is better than one. I like the first one a lot. Very. Well, like I was like, wow, the third one's coming out finally because it's been like what ten years, yeah, years. Much. yeah. 
And then I was like, all right, it's only going to be showing in theaters for one day. <laughs> I was like, oh, no. Oh, God. Straight to DVD. That's kind of like Disaster Artist. It was like one week in theater. But, but yeah, and but like it was really good, right? I have still haven't seen it. Yeah. Disaster Artist? Yeah, we have it. Oh, wow. Yeah. I mean, we don't have it. <laughs> <laughs> That's illegal. Why Close your it? face. <laughs> right. <laughs> Whose turn? Yours. Is it? I... Yeah. Dude. Damn. Wait, was it? Yeah, because you just asked the mask question. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, Michael Myers' fictional hometown of Haddonfield is located in one e- what U.S. state? I was right. Oregon. No. What? Virginia. Oklahoma. Nope. They're close. What letter does it start with? Uh, the Simpsons live there. Springfield. Ohio? <laughs> That's not a state. What? <laughs> <laughs> That's the only thing I know is Springfield. Uh, there's like 30 Springfields. So. Yeah, there's like a Springfield in every state. The Illinois? capital. Illinois. Illinois? There you go. The Simpsons live in Illinois? Springfield, Illinois. There's like 30 Springfields. There's Springfield, Ohio, Springfield, well, Michigan. There's Springfield in Florida. And in Tennessee. And in Georgia. Where do these Simpsons live? <laughs> Where do the Simpsons live? <laughs> It's gonna be like. Yes, I'm aware, Springfield. What? <laughs> <laughs> Springfield in what state? Okay, who cares? I mean, the 50s this weekend. Really? Yeah. What the hell? A little warming. Alright, the rage virus turns its victims into berserk zombie-like creatures on what 2002 film? 20 Days Later? Yeah. I didn't hear the question. <laughs> That's what you get for not paying attention. Alright. Crystal Lake. Crystal Lake. <laughs> oh, I bet you do it. Fuck. Ah. <laughs> what the fuck just happened? I see. I need a soundboard. There you go. <laughs> That's really weird. Oh, okay, here we go. Oh, yeah, you showed me that. <laughs> the Uninvited is a... You're already out of question. He just asked what the easy question was. Oh, okay. The Uninvited you is suck. a re- <laughs> Get out, you're not playing anymore. The Uninvited is a remake of what 2003 Korean horror film? Is that the right one is? No. Uh. The- <laughs> <laughs> we should have a soundboard. <laughs> <laughs> we should get a soundboard. <laughs> Do you know the way? Oh, so long. Do we know the Sorry, way? Sorry, what? Did we give up? No. Can you read the question again? I yes. <laughs> the Uninvited is a remake of what 2003 Korean horror film? <laughs> what's the winning what's the winning answer, Carla? <laughs> <laughs> Now we all got soundboards. <laughs> oh my god. A Tale of Two Sisters! I have never seen that movie. Oh by uh, Charles Dickens. It's Tale of Two Cities. I know. Mm. 21? Alright. Oh god damn it. <laughs> Pizza Parker. <laughs> oh my 
got. <laughs> Name five horror movies. Horror movies. That take place prior to the 1900s. Prior? Uh, Sleepy Hollow. No, it's for too. Hmm. Blackula? <laughs> it's a movie. Dracula? I don't know if that does or not. There's uh, some. Van there's Helsing. some. Yeah, Van Helsing. There's some versions of Dracula that take place in modern times, and then some versions take place in like right. before the time. Has anyone ever seen The Witch? Yeah. Oh yeah. I completely forgot about that movie. Yeah, that was the worst movie I've seen in yeah, my I entire like life. I heard it like I kept, like um. It got like a nine out of ten. Yeah, Stephen like, King really liked it. And I was like, oh, I'm really excited. And he really wanted me to go watch it, and I was like, <laughs> it was the worst movie. I fell asleep. It's so bad. Like for five minutes though, it wasn't very long. I fell asleep there, yeah. but yeah, I hated no. it. It was the worst. It's Name three gore horror films. Saw. Name what? Three gory horror films. Evil Dead. Saw. Dead Alive. Dead Alive. Oh. Blood Diner. Sharks. Oh, are... that was the gross one. They ate the eel. Wow. That was, uh... No, that's Dead Alive. No, I'm pretty sure it's Blood Diner. A shark. Surfer Clyde's at a Fort Pierce in- Inlet. Jaws 3? <laughs> it's so weird. It happened today. Oh. That was a really good question. I was like, oh. Wait, so a guy got bit by a shark? No, he like ran into a shark on a surfboard. Oh. Is he okay? I mean the shark. <laughs> How many people die in The Shining? Uh... How many people? Wait, yeah. did we talk? Are we talking about how many people did die in like? Die. Or did they show the bodies of, or did like happen in the movie? I don't understand the difference. Because there's like three, four, about four or five people that they show that died in the house. <laughs> I think it's three. Well, it depends because there's like five they show that died in the hotel, and then uh, what's his face? He kills two. I want to say. Uh, I don't know. Actually, one. I've seen The Shining a lot either. I love The Shining. I've seen it a lot. It's one of my favorite movies. It's two. Two? Yeah. Who dies? Uh, Jack Nicholson's character and the black guy. Oh, okay. Is black guy in that movie? Yeah. So they don't count the ones that's already did it? Did oh, show? why would they count that? They didn't die in the movie. That's why I asked. So, like, did they die in the movie? Or are they talking about, like, the bodies that they show? I'll take off for everything here. <laughs> Oh, Jaws takes place in what U.S. state? Uh, New Jersey. No. Massachusetts. Yep. Oh, really? Ah. Fucked up. <laughs> done fucked up. You done fucked up. Yep. I did not know this. Before becoming a diabetes medication spokesman, Wilford, Dr. Phil. Wilford uh, Brimley had a supporting role in what John Carpenter film? The Thing? Yeah. It's either The Thing or Halloween. <laughs> I love this game. What? Oh. What game? What game? Are we playing a game? <laughs> <laughs> Did you get it? Is that one? Yeah. A... Uh, a young couple. I woke up with my ex girl. A uh, young couple stumbles upon a small Midwest town ruled by a cult of children. Shut the corns! Oh, wait. Yeah, shit, it's only corn. Did you see Charlotte's Web? No. <laughs> 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 I did. It's mine now. No, it's mine, you fuck. Ouch. Cheater? I don't cheat. 
<laughs> oh, really? All I do is win, win. Oh my god, get out. Okay, true or false? One of the humans... <laughs> one of the human skeletons used in the tra- Texas Chainsaw Massacre was real. True or false? True. False? True! And that film also features lots and lots of real animal bones. According to his mother, on what day was Jason Voorhees born? October 31st. What? <laughs> uh, June 6th, 1966. Friday the 13th. <laughs> no. October Friday. 13th. Friday the 13th. Damn, son, where'd you yeah. find this? <laughs> <laughs> October 31st. Name one horror movie that features a hitchhiker. Hitchhiker. Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Horror movie. <laughs> uh, Human Centipede. Oh. Yeah. Oh, true. Yeah. I was thinking of, um... No one has ever done that! Not Taken. No uh, Texas taking Chainsaw. Lives. Texas, Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I don't think anyone hitchhikes. Yeah, they're driving and they pick up a hitchhiker and then she blows her brains out in the car. Oh, that's true. Anyone? <laughs> Name two horror movies to feature at a Ouija board. Ouija? A little Ouija board. <laughs> uh, Ouija, The Conjuring. Wait. Conjuring Part Two. Was what movie was the house and then the. It had a Ouija board. Was that a Ouija? Ouija board. A Luigi board. A Luigi board. Tokyo, Japan. <laughs> what actress played Julie Julie James? And I know what you did last summer. Uh, Sean Connery. <laughs> Sean Connery. <laughs> um, Scarlett Johansson. Sydney Prescott. What the fuck? Sydney Prescott. Did everybody give up? Yes. Jennifer Love Hewitt. Oh, yeah. Um, um. What movie has a curse? What movie doesn't have a curse? The Grudge. Mm, I mean, like, in real life. The Crow. That's not a horror movie. I mean... This is not the question. I just made it up just now. I forget. Oh. It's the pol- it's Poltergeist. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There's also, there's something I read about the crow, and Hey guys, it's me. Oh, um, it was about to love Bree's deaths, and because What's-His-Face died on the set, because it was was supposed to be a faint gun, but he got shot, really, um, there was, like, a whole big thing, because of him and Bruce Lee's movie, it was, like, apparently, like, on, like, foretelling his death in the crow from the Bruce Lee movies or something like that. It was really weird. It was a conspiracy theory and I was like, what the fuck? But it was like a whole big thing. Like, oh yeah, that movie's cursed and this this curse is on this family. That's pretty spooky. Yeah. It's weird. Now it's just soundboards. <laughs> but yeah, should we end the podcast here tonight, guys? Yeah. I'm a fucking idiot. <laughs> All right. Well, thanks for listening in. Whoever's listening and stayed for us to play this game. Literally no, no one. No one. Probably no one. But uh, if you like it, watch more. You mean listen? Let's listen. <laughs> <laughs> what, are they, what, are they, what are they watching? <laughs> uh, a picture. <laughs> I'm just hearing our beautiful voices. <laughs> <Eesh>. <laughs>
If you want us to review a movie or talk about a movie, let us know in the comments. What comments? Tell me on YouTube. What? Just gonna be YouTube where there's no video? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, be thanks for listening. <laughs> there better be a slideshow. Thanks for listening to Blood and Popcorn. Oh, is that the name? Oh, yeah. I'm Tiege. I am Tiege also. <laughs> <laughs> and that's Cody on Soundboard. And that's the way the cookie crumbles. <laughs> and that's the way the cookie crumbles. <laughs>